Welcome back to Muscle in the Morning. I'm Dave Palumbo and today is Thursday, August 15th, 2019. Let's find out what's going on in the world of bodybuilding and fitness. When you watch certain track and field events, at some point in the middle distance races, there's someone who usually breaks away from the field. And when we look at the race for the 212 Olympia title right now, it's almost starting to feel like Derek Lunsford is making a push towards the front. The Lunsford team has been releasing updates of their guy over the last week or two that seem to show him getting better by the day, which is scary when you consider the fact that we still have more than a month to go. But then again, it ain't always easy leading from the front, so it'll be interesting to see how he holds up coming down the home stretch. One of the other cool storylines in the 212 Olympia world that I haven't heard anyone talk about yet is the potential former champ David Henry making another run at the title. I mean, here's a guy who won the title over a decade ago, who is basically like the 212 version of Dexter Jackson in the sense that he basically hasn't aged forever. Add to that fact that there's no flex, there's no Jose Raymond, and a field of guys who don't even have half the experience that he does competing at this level, and I think you can start to make a case for a dark horse David Henry moment. The guy is an all-time freak in nature, and I don't think it's completely crazy to imagine him being in the conversation here. Every once in a while, my wife and I like to drive around and check out real estate, and every once in a while, we see one of those houses that are so insane that they give you house envy. Well, in my head, that's how I imagine everyone else feels when they look at Ruli Winkler. Ruli dropped one of those, oh my God, did you just see that updates that damn near broke the internet last week. And when you see the stuff like this, it makes you think that a 100% Ruli could be unbeatable against the lineup. And in a year that's been as crazy as anything we've ever seen, a Ruli Winkler title run doesn't seem all that far-fetched. Full disclosure, guys. I'm all in on the NFL training camp stuff that's going on right now. After the show, I'm actually going to go outside and I'm thinking about, you know, maybe running a few routes just in case the Dolphins decide they have an open roster spot for me. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, I'm pretty sure that most of the corners in the league would have a hard time trying to jam Natalia Coelho at the line. True to form, Natalia's been absolutely crushing it over the last month or so. And in a lot of people's minds, I think she's closing the gap between her and Shanique Rand. Natalia is one of the most physically gifted athletes we've ever had in the division. So if she's starting to hit her peak, she could be capable of some really incredible things. And that does it for yet another edition of Muscle in the Morning. I'm Dave Palumbo reminding you to always be true to your passions and make sure to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.